All right, Washington, you know who I am. I know you're probably wondering, who the hell is this guy? Well, this is Steve Not So Steel. And this dude has an unhealthy obsession with me. He's been a thorn in my side every single time that I go to HWF, and it makes me sick. But you know, let's hear what Mr. Aluminum has to say. It doesn't matter what you're thinking you're gonna do or how you think you're gonna do it. And if you don't hear the echo, just to let you know, I just got done training. Yeah, I'm still at it, bud. I wanna set the record straight and let the people know that this guy is a big fat phone. He's only training because in his eyes, he wants to match my energy. But guess what? We are not the same. You will never be on my level. You have nowhere to run. You have nowhere to hide. And I don't care what, try, what antics you try to pull, you're not getting away from catching these hands, my boy. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! You came into my turf, into my house, in my ring, disrespecting my fans. All right, that's it. That's enough. I have heard just about enough. This dude is giving me a freaking headache. I usually fast forward this part. Blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. All right, that's it. That's enough. You need to get it through your head, Steve, that you will never ever be on my level you don't belong in the ring with me this little fairy tale story comes to an end and no amount of security is going to save you from this ass whooping my dude and just to think this all started when i made you tap out when i made you pass out from our previous encounter well i promise you this steve may be good in the ring and the fans may love you stay 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 you're gonna wish that you never stepped in the ring with me steve it's a damn shame that your first match back is gonna be your last because when i'm finished with you i'm putting you on a shelf for good honorary wrestling federation presents remains live at the lewistown community center better known to fans as the hwf coliseum steve Steele makes his hwf in ring return versus john washington this match has been brewing for over a year washington's been trying to push this match off for the last year but on january 13th the wilderness beast gets his chance to finally shut john washington up don't miss this stack show live at the Lewistown Community Center, the HWF Coliseum. Doors open at 5, show starts at 6. I'd like to thank Brennan and Royer, Baumgartner Wrestling Photography, Mama Don's Photos, Pam Stitches, and the Curb Media Group. For HWF, I'm Drew Shannon. It's been 531 days since I had my last competition at AO Ring Old School against Go Figure John Washington. But that's okay because tonight there's no thought, and I don't care what his antics are going to be or what he thinks he's going to do. He's gonna catch the seeds. Let's get it, Buck. Yes. Oh, yes. Yeah. And if he gets in my face tonight, I got a million dollar insurance policy. Why is it a video? I didn't know it was a video. I'm trying to put his two cents in. I don't know what they're talking about after the left. Right now, Washington's not focused on speed steel tonight. Well, he better not focus on me. That's all I gotta say. I see everything. I've said John is a phenomenal athlete. He's a phenomenal athlete. He's an incredible athlete. He's an arrogant SOB. Here he comes. But he puts his focus on to make 
places. We focus on, we're focusing on you, and you're going to get a lost match. And that's the problem. We focus on our opponent, you might actually win a few matches. My problem, why is he focusing on me? What has been, what has been his issue with me? What things to say about him? Oh, believe me, John, it's on. He doesn't need the microphone. We can hear him running without it. You know what? I'm going to entertain this for just a few seconds. Because every single time when I come to this dumpster flyover town, you all say the one word I hate the most. The one word he hated the most so, was silence. I got a problem. Not only with this boneless chicken tender, Steve not so still, but the person that's responsible for making this match, Trisha Silk. She should be in the kitchen making sandwich, but instead, she's making this crap. So, I know you all looking forward to me beating this guy into a pulp. Officially a tag team match.
this I'm hitting a wall, it's the hardest thing I can't seem to get to you I'm running low on my options I'm pushing the pain through the process And I can't seem to get to you I want people to remember that, and I want John Washington to remember that. Don't believe me, I don't think he's forgotten about that. The, his attitude was looking, he came, he came out and sliced that there, kicked to the back, John Washington. Again, I've got a million dollar insurance policy that says it's not going to happen again. And Washington is now talking, fucking crap, and he's still, and that face that's closed on right there by Washington. Well, he's getting maneuvers. Oh yeah, and Big Billy just took Steve Steele off the ring apron. What is that about? Well, it's only Paige can't make the, count, make the tag. Paige is getting beat up out here, and now he has a little partner to tag in. But Big Billy can run back over. Washington always has somebody to tag in. Well, smart tag team wrestling, not necessarily legal, but... It is, but a smart tag team wrestling. It goes down again, and there's a close point to the back of the net by John Washington. Made. First time in this match we're going to see Big Billy. First time we're going to see him legally in a match here at HWF. We've seen him in the ring just that is correct. jumping Robbie Page at the end of the last show. Was he in the Battle Royal at uh, Thundercade uh, in 2023, if I recall correctly? Big Billy, I don't think so. I on. thought he was. I don't think so. I think this is his actual wrestling debut right here. Tag is up and in comes Big Billy. This crowd silently behind Robbie Page. The athletic prowess of John Washington, he is an amazing... Oh, the athletic prowess is perfectly fine. It's when he opens his mouth, it's a different story. Right. It's his attitude, it's his ego, it just gets in the way. That's what I tried to say to John Washington in my interview with him after his, his big loss of Tad Jarvis. Is it... Oh, was that after I planted him on his hand? That was. Okay. So I, I said to him, I said, dude, sometimes you just open your mouth a few times. And he just, he just didn't want to hear from me. Get out of this. He's trying to get some separation. Oh, that might work. That ring his bell. That'll work. Tag made. The ref didn't see it. The referee. I don't think the ref didn't see John it. John Washington is over there distracting him. Not like the ref. Doesn't mean that Steve still working. Wait a minute. Did we knock the ref down? That seems to be uh, Washington's mo anymore. Is pushing referees around. The referee is trying to tell him, "You got to get out of the ring, Steve Steele." Come on, Raph! And, so, and now Washington just kicking Paige in the head. Oh, they're double teaming Paige. Yeah, they're double teaming Paige right now. Did he just say screw you to me? Did no. he seriously? No. No, he did. No, he said that to Chill Rock. 
He looked at me and said it. I don't think you he said, about. screw you, Drew. Hey, Drew, none of it's about you. And there he his name. Here comes Steel. And Washington is begging off. And Hunter says, no, please no. Oh, my God, what a close line. Views. Views. 